Well, here it is. It's no further along than April. April, what, 9th now? 2018. Not bad for no work. Had a whole bunch of compost dumped here last fall, I think. Knocked it over right before winter. And then in spring, or whatever spring was, we are in Florida. Planted just by throwing a bunch of seeds in a little bag. Mixed them all up and threw them out here. Got different kinds of cabbage and got a bunch of radishes the other day. Got this whole thing of broccoli down there. You can never have too much broccoli. You know, Rax always says. You can never have too much broccoli. I'm not sure why, but it seems like a good thing. But this is bountiful. I couldn't eat all of this. There's no way. Turns out these greens, um, that's some of the best greens I've ever eaten in my life. They are really good. Uh, I think they're going to freeze good, so we're going to be okay there. <laughs> because you couldn't eat that in a couple of months. But they're like, I said, they're everywhere. Everywhere. And there's a couple of, oh, what do you call them things? They're down here somewhere. Uh, oh, there's some kale over there. I don't know if you can see it. I don't know if you can see the kale, but it's there. And then there's some of these uh, squash plants that popped up here and there. And there's actually a carrot or two, but they might be weeds. I don't know. I don't know what happened to all the carrots, but that's okay because we got lots and lots of stuff. And those, those radishes are incredible. There is a baby. He'll be coming up as these other guys start to bolt. But there's either a squash or a zucchini or something. God knows what all plants I put in there. Uh, mostly stuff that would grow, I'm hoping. Um, yeah, this is... Uh, that's a lot of stuff. Those, I think those are broccoli. Although there could be a cauliflower mixed in there too. And there's a nice, a oh, lovely little kale. Isn't he lovely? Oh, he's so cute. Yeah. And there's his big brother over there. Yeah, so that's Rax's garden. Rax is gonna be eating good. Some healthy stuff. Hope you guys are having something healthy too. Um, our body is uh, the temple of the Lord. We're to take care of that. That's uh, you can call it a mandate. You can call it anything you want. I call it good sense. Uh, take care of it. Take care of it. It was given to you freely. Y'all yeah, like my car? It's a cool car. The ducks were out here earlier, but they're not here now. They don't seem to mess with it. They just kind of walk around in it and have a good time and stuff like that. Lay a couple of eggs. Not here, of course. So, yeah. So, this is what we call Eden 3. We have three gardens. Eden 1 actually has the pigs in it right now. Um, and then later on, I'll move them and put some beans in there or something in the summer. And further up there where you see all them bags of leaves that people leave out for me to pick up. It's kind of nice of them. Uh, right behind, beyond that, there is Eden 2. And way up, I don't know if I can do this. Right up here, that's Eden. It says, that sign says, Welcome to Ray and Peggy's Eden. Yeah, we think of it that way. And that's Peggy's favorite tree. It's just starting to bloom for the year. It's a very, very large mimosa. And if you can see, I don't know if you can see it, but right in the center of that tree, there is a cherry tree growing up right inside of it. I think it actually has a pet cherry tree. It's kind of neat. I'm letting them both go. God loves you. Signing on over and out. Please subscribe. We're trying to make a living here.